Hi, it's Sandra here. Thanks for joining me for the doodle of the day. I started with, what do you know, circles again. And what do you know, made flowers. Some mornings I get up and I just do the basic. I don't know what colors I'm going to use, what shape they're going to be in, anything like that. Sometimes I think about, are they going to have stems? Are they going to have leaves around them? Am I going to have other flowers with them? Yeah, these are the things that go through my mind. Anyways, enjoy the video, and yeah. Mmm, coffee. As you can see, I decided to put leaves. And then I decided to split the leaves, because I like that effect. I then decided I'm going to do pink flowers to start uh, using a thicker marker. These ones bleed through, so I put a plastic back behind the page. It just saves it from not bleeding onto the next nice white page. At this point, I decided that this flower needed some kind of real pop of color. So in came the favorite color of mine, other than pink, yellow. This is a rarely bright yellow. I love it. So enjoy. By the time I finished doing one leaf with this gel pen, I had decided that I was not going to enjoy coloring the rest of this page. But the effect was nice once it was done. I then grabbed a ruler to give it a look of like a wall or a fence in behind. I like this effect. It really makes the, the picture pop in front of it. It gives it some kind of dimension. So I went through with the thinner brown and then later you'll see it's a little bit thicker and then just highlighted a little bit inside with some white and signed it and called it done. Thanks for joining me on March 19th, making these beautiful bright flowers.